Hey everyone, uh, I hope you all are having an awesome time during your virtual career fair, hearing from all different people in all different kinds of professions, and hopefully it kind of helps give you an idea of what you want to do for your career. Um, my name is Candace Tingle. I am a graphic designer. I work at Eastman Chemical Company. It's located in Kingsport, Tennessee. Um, I work at their global headquarters. Um, I have been in my current role there for about two years now, um, but I've been with the company for almost five. And I am so excited to share with you my journey um, as a designer and how I got to where I am today. So ever since I was little, I knew I had a love for design, whether it was coloring and matching different colors together or redesigning my Barbie house all the time. Um, I just had a passion for the artsy kind of look and feel. Um, but my passion really started developing around year I was age in high school. Um, I was very fortunate in my high school we actually had a graphic design class. Um, we learned the basics of designs to the different programs you would need to use um, to even uh, being able to compete in competitions. Uh, there was this program known as Skills USA, and it was not just a design program. Um, there were different skills uh, that you could compete in. There was masonry, there was culinary, there was cosmetology, um, but I was able to compete in a graphic design competition through that program and I competed in state pen design. Um, so I competed against 50 different uh, designers from all different states, um, which was such a really cool experience. And I got to go compete at the national level and my junior year was when I actually won at the national level. And that's kind of when my uh, passion really developed and I decided, you know, this is what I wanna do for a career. Um, so once I graduated high school, I attended a small private college in Elizabethton, Tennessee. Uh, it's called Milligan College. I received a dance scholarship from them and that was kind of a determining factor for me going there. Um, but whenever I was trying to decide major-wise, uh, graphic design wasn't actually a major. Um, it was only offered as a minor and I pushed my professors to be like, we really should have this as a major. Um, and kept pushing and I was started out as a digital media major um, with a minor in graphic design but thankfully by my sophomore year uh, they had graphic design as a major um, so I'm proud to say that I am one of the first three to graduate from Milligan with a bachelor's in science um, in graphic design uh, but with my role now, um, I use programs through Adobe, um, so you may have heard of uh, Photoshop, um, is a big one that people know of. Um, I use InDesign for web layouts and brochure designs. Um, I use Illustrator if I'm creating icons or different illustrations. Um, and now I'm kind of dabbling in video design, so there's a program called Premiere Pro um, that I've been learning here lately. Um, and we live in such a digital and tech savvy world. So one of the big things in my role is staying up to date on the latest trends. Um, we are so influenced by the designs that we see in our day to day, whether it's the design um, ad campaign for the new Nike shoe that came out or the food that you buy at the grocery store or even for your favorite musicians concerts, you are influenced by design. Um, and so that is something that I really enjoy um, because it's something that people see every day and it helps them to make a decision. Um, but in my role too, uh, you have to work at a very fast pace. You have to be adaptable and be able to work with a team, but also be a solo designer. Um, collaboration is key. Um, and be able to present to your clients is a huge thing. Being able to tell your story through your design, tell them why you concepted the way you did, um, and just being very engaged with your clients. Um, so a typical day on the job, there's not really one. Um, I support multiple different businesses or different clients. Um, so Eastman makes products that go 
into almost everything in your daily life, um, from the paint on your walls to the paint that's on your car um, to the turbo oil that goes into planes um, to the makeup that you wear to the fibers in your clothes, you name it. There is probably an Eastman additive um, in those products. Um, so for me, in a nutshell, I design for different clients such as uh, fashion fibers. I design for adhesives, which is duct tape or tapes and labels, and even diaper tabs, um, that's an adhesive. Um, I also do corporate jobs such as HR recruiting. So whenever you go to an, a recruiting event for college, um, I design uh, designs for uh, those events to help promote Eastman to people who are looking for internships, co-ops, and other jobs. Um, but my personal favorite that I work on is animal nutrition. Um, yeah, I design brochures and trade shows and social posts for veterinarians and nutritionists and farmers who look at this stuff. And I'm designing for pigs, chickens, and cows. I mean, what else could you ask for? Um, it's so it's it's interesting day to day. Um, so. <laughs> Some of the design jobs that I work on for those different businesses, um, I work on brochures, I work on web designs, like I said, social posts, trade shows, billboards, um, package designs, and also helping organize the photo shoots. Um, a couple of the big events that I've worked on are uh, Idea Academy, which we bring in different speakers, local speakers, and also national speakers. Uh, this year we had Adam Savage from Mythbusters, so it's really cool working with the different speakers on that event. Um, I also helped with the Global Sales Summit down in Miami. And this year, one of our big events is we are celebrating our 100 years as a company um, being operating for 100 years. So that's super exciting. Um, being able to help the CEO and help the company celebrate this awesome achievement. Um, so every day, like I'm saying, every day holds a different job, a different project for all the different businesses that I support. One of my favorite parts of my job is the people. Um, from where Eastman is a global company, we have over 14,000 employees in over 50 locations around the world. Um, I work with clients um, who are in the Netherlands, who are in South America, um, in the Asia Pacific region. Uh, so people from all over the world, I support different clients and I have really uh, appreciated working with them. They have helped me have a better understanding for different cultures and I just love learning from them. Um, and they make the job so much fun. Um, but one of the hardest parts of my job is what we like to call never-ending fire drills. Um, that's when you have constantly you have uh, jobs coming in urgent. They may need to be designed by lunch that day, and it's 10 o'clock um, in the morning, and or there may be jobs that people forgot about, and suddenly they move up on your priority list. Um, so being adaptable and being good at managing your time. Uh, really comes into play during this role. So with telling you all this, I am still very new in my career. I still have a lot to learn, um, but I really enjoy it. And I hope to continue to grow in my career and my leadership skills. Um, one of my goals is to hopefully become a creative director and oversee the work of the creative team, um, helping make the designer's jobs easier when working with the client and just helping um, be a good support for the team. Um, but before I go, I have a couple of tips for you. Um, when you find a career, find one that it, you're passionate about. It really does make your job not feel like work. Um, it makes it really enjoyable. Um, when you go to college, focus on your major, but also think outside the box. What classes or maybe minors you could pick up on to help well-round you in your career. Um, for me, I added on photography and public relations, so that helped me give a better understanding to my job. Um, but lastly, start looking at internships early. Um, this is probably one of the biggest pieces of advice I can give you. Um, do not wait till your senior year of college to look for one. Uh, build your resume early on, and you will learn and grow so much during that time. 
Um, I started my internship when I was 19 at Eastman, um, and the internship wasn't even in design. It was actually in marketing communications, and I would not be in the position that I am today or be the designer I am today without that opportunity. So I hope you find this helpful. Uh, I hope you have a great rest of your time learning about other careers, and I wish you all the best of luck. Thank you for listening.